Hey everybody, it's Paulo Flaherty here, and I've got a question for you today. What would the world be like, or what would your communications be like, if ISPs operated the same way as cell phone carriers? Imagine a situation where, with ISPs operating the same as cell phone carriers, every time you wanted to change from one ISP to another, you have to buy a new laptop. And the laptop that you ha that you bought had to be one that was approved by the ISP for use on their network. Imagine every time if you wanted to go out and buy an Alienware PC or if you wanted to go out and buy the latest Mac notebook or laptop or whatever and you couldn't do it because they weren't available to your ISP. And further to that, imagine if you then got hold of your new laptop after moving to your new ISP and found that, that you know what, you can't run the software you want on it because the software has to be approved by the hardware manufacturer in conjunction with the ISP. This may sound like a really really stupid situation considering the cost of laptops and you know the cost of an ISP for a year. But you know what it's a situation that we do that we go through and deal with every day especially in the US not so much here in Europe but especially in the US in terms of our cell phones. Now Many cell phone handsets are just as expensive as an entry level or low low end laptop. You can pay three, four hundred dollars or more, five, six hundred dollars for a handset sometimes. And yet you can only use it with certain networks. Here in Europe, things are things are very, very different on that front. I can buy any handset I want. And as long as I take a contract and get a, I get a SIM card with the with the network that I want to be on then I can put it on any network that I want to put it on and I can move it from network to network just by changing the SIM card. Now sometimes okay you can buy a phone here discounted because of your contract with the ISP which are sorry with the cell phone carrier which locks your phone to that cell phone carrier however when you finish your contract you are allowed to unlock your phone and move it to any other network but you know that's beside the point the point that I'm trying to make here is that cell phone handsets are expensive we buy them they're our hardware once we purchase them they are also they have also become very very central to our communications and they've become central to our productivity and they are just as essential to our productivity in some cases as our laptops are they allow us to do many of the same functions while we're on the move and stay in contact but why is it that while we wouldn't put up with this behavior from ISPs, we put up with it from cell phone manufacturers. Cell, phone man cell phones cost approximately the same as an entry-level laptop. Yet if somebody was to tell you, you can't use your laptop with us because we only allow, say, Apple or we only allow, say, um, Dell PCs on our ISP, you'd be in uproar. The whole place would be in war over it. So again, why do we allow this to happen with our cell phone handsets? Questions and comments, welcome. All right, take care. I'm Paulo Flaherty from pauloflaherty.com. See you.